Hi there, in this video we're going to be solving the following problem involving adding and subtracting vectors and multiplying scalars, which are just uh, numbers you multiply, let's say constants or uh, coefficients. We're going to be multiplying it throughout the indi these individual coordinates here. So starting with the first question right here, we have the vector u, which I'll write down I suppose. It's going to be a 2, 1, and a 3. This is the vector u, adding on to 2v rather. So let's go ahead and do that transformation right now. So 2 multiply 3, it's going to give us a 6 here, a comma, then we have that. 2 multiply 1 is a 2. Negative 2 multiplied 2 is going to be negative 4, and that's the, the transformation for 2v. Let's do the last one, negative 3w, so negative, then 3w, so let's just do that transformation. 3 multiply 4 is 12, comma, then 3 multiply negative 3, or sorry, negative 1 is negative 3, and this last one's a 3. So let's add these two vectors together first. That'll give us an 8, a 3, and a, what is that, negative 1. So now we're going to have this subtract this vector over here. Okay, so let's do that. Uh, 8 subtract 12 is negative 4 comma, 3 subtract, negative 3 is going to be 3 add 3, because the negatives would cancel out, so we have 6 here, positive 6, negative 1, multiply that, sorry, negative 1 subtract 3, actually, is going to give us negative 4 here, and this is the end answer, this is the resulting vector from this transformation here. So now let's move on to question, I guess in this case it's question n, it's the next question in general. So again, 2u, so let's go ahead and do that calculation. It's gonna be two multiply that, four, and I think you're getting the hang of this. It's literally just multiplying it through, then adding or subtracting each individual coordinate. So let's keep, let's do this quickly then. So that, six, so this is the first vector there, adding on to 3v, so that's going to give us a nine, a three, and what is this, a negative six. And subtract w, so nothing's being done to this one. Great, so let's add these together. That's give us 13, a five, and a zero. Subtract this one over here. So 13 subtract four is gonna give us a nine comma. We have five subtract that, you're adding it on, so it's a six. Zero subtract one is negative one. And this is the answer for question N, the next one we just did. Let's move on to the last question now. So let's go ahead and do that. It's gonna be two subtract three, that's negative one comma. We have one subtract one, zero. Three subtract two, that's gonna be adding, so it's gonna be five here. And this was the u subtract v part. Now let's add on the w, which is 4, negative 1, and 1. So adding it on, we're going to get uh, 3 here, 3, um, negative 1, and we're going to get, what is that, a 6. And that is the correct answer. And I think you got the hang of it by now. If you have any questions, though, feel free to ask in the comment section below. And as usual, I do hope you're having a fantastic day.